Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Makeup with K for Candy. My name is Candy and today's makeup look is going to be on this look right here which can be used to clip mind-blowing pictures. Also if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon for future updates. So let's get started. I'm already done with my brows for which I've used the Wet n Wild brow pencil in the shade Ash Brown. Next step is to apply any adhesive, I've used a transparent one. Then to prime my eyelids, I'm using an eye primer by Wet n Wild. It kind of locks down your eyeshadow. By the way, how's your lockdown? I hope you all are keeping well. For concealing my lids, I'll be using the Wet n Wild concealer in the shade Medium Tawny. I always prefer applying it with a blender. To set my concealer, I'm using L'Oreal Infallible Compact in the shade 123 Warm Vanilla and will apply it using my Maybelline brush. The brushes from Maybelline are really soft. What do you have to say about it? Let me know in the comment section below. For eyeshadow, I'm using Huda Beauty's Desert Dust Palette from which I'll be initially taking the dark brown shade OVD. And the brush for application is from Anastasia Beverly Hill. The brown shade is just for the crease. If you are a beginner, always opt a light shade for crease. I'm using a lip gloss from Lakme Absolute in orange shade so that the eyeshadow color looks more vibrant and stays for long. And also use any sticky gloss, even the color tone does not matter. I'm using my ring finger for application. For outer corner of the eye, I'm taking this color Amethyst from the same palette. In a corner, I'm using this orange shade known as Blazing. Now for the center of my lid, I'll be using this pigment from MAC in the shade Vanilla A27. Now I'll again be taking this shade for below the waterline to give a nice transition. For inner corner highlights, I'll be using the pearl white shade Angelic from the same palette. Mascara, I am using the Maybelline Colossal Waterproof Mascara. A lot of you guys want to apply lashes but fail to do so. For a fuller lashes, you can always apply two coats on both the eyes. highlights 
I'll be using the same pigment from MAC in the shade Vanilla. Coming back to face, I'll start with Nivea's moisturizer. My skin is kind of dry these days, so it nourishes my face properly. For sunblock, I'm using the green tea sunblock from Plum. By the way, they sell all the vegan products. For primer, I'm using the primer by Color Essence. I'm using these two foundations. First one is Fit Me 2H0 and the other is Laurel True Match Golden Beige. I'm also mixing the Stroke Cream by MAC. For application, I'm using a slight wet beauty blender so that the application goes seamless. And also try taking the least quantity of foundation because when you use a beauty blender, it packs the quantity of foundation you apply. Concealer, I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me in the shade 10 Light. I'm applying it on my acne also. To set concealer, I'm using the Compact by Laurel Infallible in the shade 123 Warm Vanilla. I like using my Compact on the T-zone. To contour my face, I'm using the NYB Concealer in a deeper tone. The shade name is Toffee with my Real Technique brush.
like to dab my nose later by the beauty blender so to give it a natural effect. For blush, I'm using Maybelline Fit Me in the shade pink. I like applying the leftover on brush on my nose, forehead, chin to give face a even tone. For highlighter, I'm using my all-time favorite sugar in the shade 02 Gold Glory with my Real Technique flat brush. For lipstick, I'm using the Kiko Milano in the shade 09 Strawberry Red for my lower lip. Over it, I'll be applying the Amethyst Shadow. For my upper lip, I'm taking this lipstick by Sugar which has no name, it's a mini sugar or a sugar cube I guess. Last but not the least, I'll be highlighting my collar and center shoulder bone. This is pretty much it. I hope you guys like this look. Give a thumbs up to the video. I'll see you soon with another makeup video. Till then, take care. Keep smiling.